Well, family history is a very important aspect of assessing somebody's risk for schizophrenia because we know that schizophrenia runs in families and that the likelihood of an individual developing schizophrenia is directly related to how much, how much genetic background, how many genes they share with their family member who has the illness. So for example, if you have a, in the general population, the average rate of schizophrenia is one in a hundred in their lifetime will develop schizophrenia. Makes it not a frequent disease, but not a rare disease either. Um, if you have a parent with schizophrenia, your chances are about 10 percent, 10 out of 100, so 10 times higher. If you have a brother with schizophrenia, it's about 13 uh, percent, or if you have a sibling. If you have a twin, and the highest, obviously, is associated with an identical twin, then your chances are 50 times out of 100, or 50 times greater than the uh, general population. So we know that it runs in families. We know that uh, the likelihood of developing it, if you have a family member, is, depends on how closely you related, you know, how closely you are related to that person. Mm -hmm.